So uh, when I was seven, I did something, something sick, something depraved. Uh, this would be the first of uh, many things that I did that would be sick and depraved. But it's something that kind of like I, I, li I lie awake at night thinking about sometimes. Um, so uh, on, our on our block, you know, uh, m my brother and I, we would play with the neighborhood kids and stuff. And we had our group of friends. And there were like these older kids that lived um, at the bottom of the block. And like, you know, older kids do, they, they, would, they would pick on us. They were like a few years, like three years older than us or something. So they would pick on us. Um, and I don't remember what they did this one time. Uh, but whatever they did, we decided that we were going to get back at them. Um, so uh, we. We found like a beer bottle because there's, you know, there's lots of beer bottles lying around in the neighborhood. Uh, so we found this like old beer bottle, and it might have even had some like rainwater, some leftover beer in it. Um, and we decided that we were going to make like some kind of foul concoction in this in this beer bottle. So um, we so there was the leftover beer, and then there was a puddle of like uh, with like a sheen of anti uh, uh, antifreeze on it. Uh, like the, you know, like it was like a green puddle. So we like some of that mud and antifreeze we uh, we put into the bottle, and um, we had like a, a magic marker, and we took the insides out of the magic marker. You know, there's like this like kind of like substance inside of it. We put that in the bottle, and uh, we of course we pissed in it. So uh, we had like this pissed in the bottle, and you know, we, we I don't know, we put like all kinds of crap in there, and we decided that. The next time that we get into a confrontation with these kids, like one of us would throw it on them, this bottle. And we were like, oh, yeah. And then we let it sit in the, in the alleyway near my house, and it just got even more disgusting. There was like some kind of like steam rising from it and everything. It was really foul. And then, I, you know, I, inevitably, there was a time and, uh, where like some kind of, uh, you know, they started picking on my friend, and I'm like, I'm going to go and get the bottle. So I took it upon myself to go and get this bottle. And uh, I can, I, and I got the bottle and I walked down the street like, oh, we're gonna show them. And uh, I saw them all standing there and they were like talking trash or whatever. And I said, hey, you know, Phil or what? And, I, and he turned around and I threw this, this bottle of piss and magic marker insides and antifreeze and mud and everything. And I threw it at him. And he jumped back, and it splashed him. And it was like, all you, there was just like a streak of mud on his face, kind of, and on his shirt. And then he had the inside of the magic marker dangling off of his earlobe. And he just looked like completely violated and disgusted, like, ah, oh, what did you do to me? And I looked around at my friends, thinking that they were going to be like, yeah right on and they looked at me like I was some kind of sick criminal too <laughs> and like everybody just looked disgusted and then it was like what did you do you sicko and you know I was seven and I started crying and everything and I'm like oh my God, I, I thought we said we were gonna do it and everyone's like I didn't know you were actually gonna throw it on them and uh, but the, here's the part that stands out in my memory. I was walking away from this, and everyone's just standing there in like stunned and disgusted silence, kind of. And as I'm walking, I looked, and there was one of my neighbors, like this uh, this older guy, standing in the doorway, and he just looked at me, and he shook his head, and he's like, "You're sick." You're just nasty, disgusting little boy. And I was like walking up the street crying and everything. So that's when, I mean, I, I think about that, the look on that guy's face. You're sick. You're a nasty, disgusting boy. And it was true. I was. And I think of that a lot. Um, so that, that, that's my sick story. So there you go.